When the ruthless cattle barons of Texas invaded the fertile valleys of the north, relentlessly wreaking their malice on everything and everybody in their path, only one obstacle stood in their way. Rugged, granite-hard Sam Brassfield. Brassfield loomed as large in the annals of the West as the rugged peaks of his vast domain, where the barbed wire boundaries were defied by the free-range trespassers and their hired guns. I know why you're in town, Sam. You come to yell to your Cattlemen's Association. They start sending in hired guns there, calling them range detectives. I came here to tell the Cattlemen's Association to stay out of this. Anybody wants trouble, they'll have it with me. Big Clay Matthews was the unscrupulous brain behind the invaders, even setting neighbor against neighbor. I don't like the way you're grabbing land. If you say I ever fenced one acre that I didn't own, you're a liar. But there was one neighbor. You know what I like most about you? Well, I've been waiting for you to tell me. You're the only wrangler I ever knew who smells sweet, even in a corral. Joan Caulfield portrays Charlene Travers, whose love for Sam Brassfield was as intense as her brother's hate. Even ready to marry that girl just to get a hold of my land. <laughs> Sam Brassfield was surrounded by fiercely loyal men, like the legendary Johnny Quattro, who lived to love and loved to fight. I kill you. All you've got to remember is you saw Sam Brassfield cutting his own fence. You hear? Yeah, yeah. This was the time of fury the West will never forget, when violence and treachery so twisted the interpretation of the nation's grazing laws that the President of the United States had to intervene. I'm sorry, sir, but as a Wyoming cattleman, this becomes a matter of life and death to me. And if I'm forced to, I'll fight it on that basis. You mean literally, sir? With every gun and every man on the Teton. <laughs> 